All right, I'm going to show you how to make uh, some movie posters in Midjourney. I'm just going to walk you through how to build out a prompt for that, and we're going to get it really good and detailed, and we're going to kind of change some things about it. And we're going to walk through how we would do that whole process with that type of prompt. Okay, so to start, I'm going to tell ChatGPT that I want to develop a prompt for movie posters, and I'm going to describe... Um, kind of what I want it to do and I'm going to tell it to give me a couple different prompts for mid journey and I'm going to tell it to give me prompts for a couple different movie ideas. Cool so here's a prompt I'm going to work with I'm going to pass that in I'm going to see what it gives me and uh, it's going to say you know hey we're going to make up this uh, you know vintage movie uh, for a film titled City of Shadows and uh, we're just going to see where this goes right so I'm going to throw this prompt in I'm going to see what we get I'm going to see if we get Leonardo DiCaprio and Scarlett Johansson in there. We'll see what happens. Um, this next one is a f uh, science fiction film called Galactic Rebellion with Chris Hemsworth and Zoe Saldana. It's a fierce alien warrior. So I'm interested to see what goes on with that. I'm actually just going to throw all these in there. Well, not all of them, but I'm going to throw them in there. Okay. Ryan Reynolds, don't care. Just kidding. Um, let's see. Uh, Fractured Minds with Jake Gyllenhaal and Natalie Portman. All right, let's see what happens with that. And then if we don't like any of these, um, you know, we're going we're gonna to move that, move it around. I'm going to say, uh, can you do this for some new Marvel movie ideas? Uh, make up 10. And so we're going to see what like Marvel movie posters it can make. All right, and so it's coming up with this one. I'm interested to see what it's going to do. Um, one thing to, to know about Midjourney is the titles of these are probably not going to come through. They're not going to have they're going to have words that make sense. That's one thing that I think is going to be an extreme improvement on um, on Midjourney and all image generation stuff. All right, so we're going to creep through these previews because a couple of them have come through. So let's kind of assess how this one went. So it's supposed to be a vintage movie, Leonardo DiCaprio and Scarlett Johansson. Um, roughly, I'm getting that vibe. Uh, City of Shadows, uh, some word that kind of looks like shadows came through. That's interesting. Um, the poster should feature strong contrast between light and shadow. Yep, does that. Uh, incorporate elements like cityscapes, rain-soaked streets, and vintage cars into the background. So overall, that works. I do think that Leo and Scarlett Johansson don't really come through that strong, but um, if it's an old movie, okay, cool. Um, this one right here, so what is this supposed to be? So this is Chris Hemsworth and Zoe Saldana. I actually don't really think I know really who those people are, um, but it's definitely a kind of like science fiction film, so that's, that's pretty neat. So I'm going to go ahead and, and work on that. All right, so let's go down. Psychological thriller with Jake Gyllenhaal and Natalie Portman. Um, I think this is the best depiction of his face. I don't really think that's a good one of hers. But overall, I like the concept that they kind of built up. Um, there's no words, which uh, was kind of lacking a little bit. But overall, that's, that's pretty interesting. So let's see. I think we're still waiting on some of the other ones to come through. I put in a bunch of other ones. And sometimes these do take a little while, but just hold tight. One thing I'm going to do to kind of throw a wrench in it is I'm going to ask for a mocked up version of, I think I like this one. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and say, boom, give me that one. And then I think I'm actually going to say, let me give that one, this top left one there. And that's how we'll get the upscaled versions. And looking through these, um, I kind of want to spin this again, so I'm just going to say, hey, give me the whole thing again. So we're going to see what happens then. Okay, so this is the first Marvel. Um, don't like this one at all. Didn't really come through. It's supposed to be Doctor Strange and the Illuminati. And we have Benedict Cumberbatch and Chadwick Boseman from Black Panther, and they're in there, and I don't really see... Uh, either of them necessarily I just it, it doesn't make a lot of sense to me so that's not really a good one um, so I'm gonna take this one actually I'm gonna show you I'm gonna take this prompt pass it back in and I'm gonna say this prompt did not clearly 
depict either of the actors requested. And then I'll paste that in there. And I'm going to say, can you fix this by adding more detail? And so we're going to see what happens if I do that. And that's kind of how you refine these prompts. You just express the problem back to GPT, and then it should give me give you some output that you can then run again and see what happens there. Okay, let's see what the deal is. So we have um, Marvel spinoff, a Black Widow. And I do think this is pretty good. I think I kind of like um, this one, even though it doesn't really, it's not really Scarlett Johansson's face. Like, I think it could have been a little bit, a little bit clearer depiction there. Um, but I do get what they're trying to do. I'm going to maybe spin that one again. I'm going to ask for variations of this or variations of the whole thing again. Um, but I am going to look over here. Okay, so we have this Cosmic Avengers, Chris Hemsworth, the Thor, Brie Larson. And so I am getting a pretty, yeah, that makes it's pretty clear. Um, I'm seeing some Thor over here. Uh, overall, the actors' faces are not that good. I think this is pretty decent. Um, I'm going to try that one. So I'm going to say, let me upscale that. Uh, ultimately, I'm just going to spin that one again. I'm going to see what the deal is. I'm going to say, I'll take this post right here. I don't think I did this yet. So I'm going to say, um, imagine, I'm going to paste this like way more detailed uh, prompt, pass that in, see what happens. I'm at the max jobs. Um, we're going to see what the deal is. I'm going to save a couple of these. Okay, so one of the things that I found with the Doctor Strange poster request is about the closest I could get was something like this. And uh, it's pretty cool, but altogether, um, not 100% able to to really get where I wanted. They just meshed the faces so much that it was it was kind of hard to distinguish the characters. This one ultimately uh, turned out pretty cool. I really do like that one. Um, now, not exactly Natalie Portman, but just somebody, not exactly Jake Gyllenhaal, but pretty pretty darn close, right? So, um, the Marvel and X-Men crossover, I ran that another time because it didn't really hit on any characters that I would think would, would really be X-Men versus Marvel, except for this guy kind of looks like Wolverine, this guy kind of looks like Thor. So, we do have something going on there. Ultimately, that's the one I'm going to take. I'm going to ask for some versions of that as well. I do have a lot of things in my queue still. I'm kind of working on getting those all pumped out. And let's see. Yeah, I asked for another version of this. I think this is pretty clear, but this is a this face. Super weird face here. So I think I'm going to try this one. And I'm going to see what an upscale version of this looks like. It's probably going to be sort of weird. I respun the Scarlett Johansson one and I think that um, something like this, this one um, or this one turned out pretty good. So I'm going to try upscaling both of those and see how they, they work out. Um, but yeah, cool. I'm going to ask uh, ChatGPT to give me, uh, uh, can you give me 10 prompts for James Bond movies, movie ideas? And we're going to see what it does with the James Bond prompts. Now, I upscaled this one for the X-Men, and it's it's just horrible. So sometimes when you pick that of those previews, those four, out of the quad, or whatever it's called, it, it doesn't always come through the way that you want. This one, though, I think is, is pretty good. Um, resemblance of both the actors, and it's like a clear enough um, design it's not too over the top it's not really too far in either direction so i, I think that that's uh, pretty good so i'm going to try some of these james bond prompts and we're going to see how these come through i think that well, let's see we're going to see um it's going to be cool let's try this james bond and scuba gear let's see what that looks like um And try this. Okay, cool. Now, so this one, this one looks a lot like Scarlett Johansson, especially with like an artistic mock-up. So, overall, I would say this one is a a, a win, right? Very Soviet, um, which is kind of in the prompt. 
uh, Russian iconography and a dark color palette. So I think this one achieved what we wanted. All right, I'm going to try to do, let's see. Mm. Oh, the Cardinals Vault. Give that a swing. And uh, then we'll hang, we'll hang tight and we'll see how those turn out. All right, here's some of the output that we got. Um, I think this is a pretty good one for a James Bond movie. Uh, the other one that he gave me up here, uh, these options, didn't care about them as much. I also don't know why it didn't just pick um, the guy who's been playing James Bond for a while. I think that would make a lot more sense. I think it's, it's you know, a real spinoff. At least this guy um, looks a lot more like Bond than the other guy. So I, I, this is just very, very Bond um, features going on here. So anyhow, um, I think at this point you should you should kind of be able to see where you can go with this. Hopefully you made some cool stuff um, with this guide here. Hope this is helpful. Thanks for watching. We're going to go over some other prompts in the next video.